calendar, calendar is super easy. Um, if you just click on calendar, you'll see your events and tasks added to your calendar. Um, and here, again, you can edit your task. Um, you can track your time, do whatever you'd like, and it'll automatically take you back to your task list. Okay, um, let's go back to calendar and you can edit your event or you can add more events directly onto your calendar here. You click on your start date, we'll say today, we'll end it on 29th. Right now is 3 o'clock, 3 p.m. We'll end it at 5 p.m. And we'll give it a title. Um, let's see, testing you. And click on save. And now we should have a new event set up here. Now that's quick. I mean, a calendar is pretty, pretty simple. All right, so lastly, we're just going to go over discuss time and profile. Um, discuss, you can have user group discussions. Here you can click on the discussion that's already available. You can subscribe to that if you're logged in or unsubscribe. Uh, we'll click on back and create a new discussion. We'll start discussion. We'll say um, testing project four for Joomla 1.7 and um, say 1.7 is the bomb and save. And of course, the author is already subscribed to it, which is myself. We can edit here or we can toggle this or we can delete this right away. All right, so that's a quick starting discussion. The topics will be shown in there and uh, you're pretty much done with that. Discussion is very pretty self-explanatory. Um, time, time is very easy to add for each task. You just click add, you'll select your task, testing kickoff, time, we've spent two hours on this, uh, quick note, um, let's see, we'll just say kickoff going well and save. And testing kickoff, super user, kickoff going well. So it'll show the user in here and their time. Okay. Um, profile, this will be the profile that is shown for the user that is currently logged in, okay, which is um, myself. And that's it for profile. It's pretty simple. Now, one thing I didn't go over is you will notice that when you're in projects, task, files, calendar, discuss, you'll notice in here that you can actually edit the section within each section here. So if we're under projects, we can edit. Instead of going back to the config, you can edit your access settings in here as well which is really cool, instead of keep going back to config as I showed you a second ago.